kids, Kevin O'Brien here. Pack your bags and take some Dramamine. We're hitting the road to Columbia, Missouri, home of education, culture, cuisine, and yes, daytime television. It's Pepper and Friends, or at least Pepper and Moderately Close Acquaintances. You know, there has been some criticism of television, the fact that there's not enough culture on the tube, right, especially of Pepper and Friends. Well, we're trying to change that today by bringing a little bit of culture to your life with a gentleman by the name of Withington Spoon. Welcome to our show, Withington. Thank you, Paul. It's very nice to be here. <laughs> yes. No, you're going to... <laughs> Are you okay, Withington? I'm, I'm just so excited. We're, we're bringing culture. Yes. You know, culture is so important, especially on television. Yeah. And so what we've decided to do is have a contest. Yeah, yeah. But why did you pick our show, wanting to come on our show to, to bring culture? Well, we've watched all sorts of television shows mm -hmm. and decided yours needed the most help. Oh. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're welcome. Yeah. So how are we going to do this? How are we going to bring culture into the television? We've had a, a statewide contest for poets, mm -hmm. and we've found a poet uh, from Missouri who's absolutely brilliant, and we'll read her poem oh. live on the air. Oh, that's great. And you know what? You can go over to Tiger Tail's bookstore because they do poetry readings, too. Oh, yeah. marvelous. I'd love to go there. Yeah, Rosemary's right over there. I mean, she'd be happy to have you. Rosemary, she's Smashing. right there. Oh, there she is, right there. Smashing. Hello, Rosemary. How are you? <laughs> is she standing by the llama? No, 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 the llama's outside. Oh, all right, I didn't know. I okay, so who is this person that you brought out now? Oh, her name is Clementine, Clementine, and she's the winner of our poetry contest. Very cultured. She's highly cultured. Uh-huh. Highbrow. Yeah. Very and, highbrow. And, 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 and you did a search across all of Missouri. The entire state. And, and this she's is... the winner of our contest. Okay, shall we welcome her right now? <laughs> Let's. Okay, so, so Clementine. Clementine is back here. We've got the music for Okay. <laughs> Clementine. Oh, there she is. <laughs> oh, 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 you're sick. Oh, don't burn the carpet. That wouldn't be very helpful. <laughs> Hi, Clementine. <laughs> Welcome to our show. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, okay. oh. So, where are you from, Clementine? Oh, I'm from um, Fayette. Oh, okay. Oh, way up over there. Yeah. Now, you wrote some poems? Um, actually, I just want one. You wrote one poem? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm And what's the name of your poem? Well, poem. What? Oh, that's the name that's of it? That's the name of it. It's very, it's very intellectual. If it's got a poem, it's very intellectual. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. Well, can we hear the poem? Oh, yes. Okay. I got it right here. Uh -huh. It's the okay. winner. Okay. okay. Does, does she win anything for this? Yeah, she got an appearance on Pepper and Friends. Oh, that's right, because we needed the most help. Right? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, all right. This is her prize. And I'm uh, glad to be here. Oh, we're so, so glad to have you here, Clementine. Place. What do you do for a living, Clementine? <laughs> Don't bring that up. Don't bring that up. Oh, okay. It, it, it has to do with pig races, and it's it's, it's rather it's rather disgusting. <laughs> you said you wouldn't bring that up. I didn't. I didn't. He did. I you didn't. just said pig races. Don't get angry. Read the poem. Don't get okay, angry. just go ahead and read okay. the poem. Okay. <clears throat> There once was a gal from Fayette who married her family Payette. They both was on Springer. It was a real humdinger. Paul Pepper ain't called but may yet. It's my winning poem right there. I really don't know what to say about any of this. How many other people are you planning to bring on the show? Well, we've got the llama. Uh -huh. But the llama doesn't do poetry. No. no. So we're stuck mm. at this point. Okay. Well, do you feel that this little uh, segment actually did add more culture to television? I think it, I think, I think, I think, uh, not quite. But, but we're hoping maybe we can stop. Yeah. It's, it's a baseline. Sure, sure it is. Okay, and this outfit that you have on, that's yes. great. Thank you. Yeah. Now, yes. where would you wear that thing? Uh, to the, the, the bookstore. To the... Oh, Tiger Tail's bookstore. Tiger Tail's bookstore. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Okay. <laughs> Clementine, you're doing just great. Thank hey, we want to thank you all ooh, for coming. Yes, ooh, what? Ooh. She goes fishing in Branson. Yes, I went fishing in Branson and I caught a catfish. Where'd you catch it? Right here in the lip. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. You got another one? Are you going to go fishing again? Um, uh, yeah, I guess I will. I'm going to go right after here. I'm going to go fishing. Have you got worms? Well, yes, but the doctor gave me something for it. <laughs> That's it, isn't it? Culture. <laughs> Highbrow. Right, right there. Very good. And I'm glad Highbrow. you started right here on Pepper and Friends. Yes, I am too. Really nice. Yes. Now, if you're wondering who these people are, okay, 
Witherspoon, uh, Withington Witherspoon. Okay. Withington Spoon. Withington Spoon, whatever the heck your name is there. <laughs> okay, you actually are from Upstage Production. Right? Yes, we do interactive murder mysteries. Mm -hmm. We perform all over the place. Yeah, and when, when is your next interactive murder mystery? Fried, somebody, somebody probably would like to kill you right now. Friday at the Mount Pleasant Winery in Augusta. Uh -huh. uh, they can uh, call 888-WHODUNIT and find out. We also do Christmas parties. We do, we do shows for private parties, uh, holiday parties, things like that. It's a lot yeah, of fun. Yeah, yeah. Did you send that professor guy that was on here a uh, couple of months ago? Oh, yes, I did. Yeah. Yes, I sent yeah. him. He was very interesting. Wasn't Maybe we he? can get him back again. Maybe so. And Clementine, uh, yes. what are you going to do after you leave here now? I'm going fishing. Yeah? And then after that, I'm going back to the pig races. Oh, is that what you do <laughs> for a living? Yes. That's right. Okay. That's right. Well, I, I wouldn't make fun of that if I were you. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. no, no. Well, it was a pleasure having both of you here, and I really feel that our show uh, has been lifted up just a little bit with the culture. Will you come back again? I don't think I'm leaving. Oh, you're not leaving? I have a slight problem with transportation. What's that? Well, I uh, rode in on the llama. Oh, and Tony's waiting out there yes. right now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. Okay. And go, go see Rosemary over at Tiger Tales, because maybe she'll let you read poems. Woo! Oh, oh, that'd be Woo! Really <laughs> <laughs> we'll take a break. We'll be right back. Stay with us. Wow.